Six, that's Scotty McCreary and Let It Snow right here on the Afternoon Cartoons on Pure Country C106. Live in studios, we got some special guests here today. We're going to bring on Dan from Dan Dan, the Roofing Man. Dan, thanks for being on the show. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Yeah, you're welcome. Would you like to introduce your partner here as well? Yes, we have Anthony Yates with us. So. Tremendous, Yates. tremendous, beautiful help. All right, sounds good. All right, it's a pleasure so, to be here. Of course, well, thanks for thanks for actually coming in, too, as well. So, now, listen, Dan Dan the Roofing Man is something that Fred says on his big morning show, right? So, now I finally get a chance to meet you as well. So it's, yes, a, so, it's a pleasure to have you on the show today. That's right. All right, so let's talk about what Daniel's Roofing actually offers in this area, because you're able to buy in bulk to save folks money. Now, tell me something about that. Would you? So, Chad, yes, roofing is expensive. We all know that. But, yes. unfortunately... Without a roof, your house is a mess. You gotta have a roof and you gotta have a good roof. You gotta keep that weather out. You gotta keep your house dry. So what we've done is we've been able to secure some bulk buys for ice and water, which is the rubber membrane that goes on around the chimneys, valleys. We buy it in bulk to keep the price low. All right. Because that stuff does get pretty expensive. Expensive. Yep. Nails. And we buy local. Too. We buy so local. That's a major thing. We, you know, we buy from our local suppliers here in town. So, um, so you're also yeah. helping there as well. So you're helping yep. out with the local economies as well as helping the actual customer too to actually save some money as well. That's mm -hmm. correct. All of our uh, products are right here local. Uh, that's a big thing. Plus you guys are veterans too. Yeah, I know you are. I'm a veteran. Yes, sir. Are you Navy? U.S. Navy. Ah, <laughs> see, I'm Navy as well. See? Is that right? Yeah, that's great. That's right. I served on the USS Carl Vincent. So we, we buy ice and water. We buy synthetic, which is the old version of felt paper. All right. And then nails, uh, anything we can save to purchase, we can pass those savings to our consumer, Man, to our is... end result. Which is uh, great. Speaking of that end result, you guys have testimony after testimony after testimony about people calling here and telling us uh, of how good that y'all treated them, how excellent the actual work was, plus you guarantee your work. Let's talk about that. So. Yeah, Anthony, you want to talk about our uh, uh, five-year warranty? guarantees and about your warranties, if you don't mind. Yeah, so most of the shingle brands um, that we use locally, like Certainty, Owens Corning, they come with their the manufacturer warranty. Um, you know, they come with like a basic manufacturer warranty, but as a company, we like to go the extra mile and, and be someone that can be trusted. Um, and then, you know, we, we have a five year workmanship warranty on all of our work. So that means, you know, five years from now, like, Hey, something's going wrong. And they, they can give us a call and they can trust in us and rely on us to come back and see if it's an issue that we can help with. You know, we, we stand by what we do and we, we want to help folks and, and we stand behind our work. So and really, if five years goes by and Miss yeah. Smith has a problem, she calls us, we'll help her. You yeah, know? For, sure. for sure. We'll definitely yeah. help her one way or another. It's just, as a standard, you got to have a written warranty. So that's what we provide for customers. you got to have a written warranty in there somewhere, of course. Because yes. To. Got to be official. <laughs> That'll be official, but y'all... But we're going to help. But if, yeah, we're here to help miss, folks. Yeah, which is... Something I think is lost out here, like a lot. Not not with everyone, but there's a lot of people that are lost as far as with that very concept. So kudos to you guys for actually standing on what you're talking about here. Because I know after you leave here, if, if uh, someone was to call you, you're going to go out there and do your very best to help them, aren't you? Yes, sir. Chad, what we have, we have a, it's kind of like, the best way to explain it is like a, I don't know, a donut shop, right? You have, you have a process if you have the person making up the batter and then it goes into the deep fryer and then it, it's boxed and then it goes to the co uh, consumer to get fresh donuts, right? Well, what happens with us, a customer calls us. It goes to our office. Miss Diana puts it in our system. One of our salesmen that's close to that area will pick it up. We'll call the customer. We'll come visit in person. We'll measure the roof up, give you a, a quote, a price. And then if you have hail damage or anything, we're going to not just stop right there. We're going to advise you to call your insurance. Okay. Your, our quote is still good. That's not going to change. So we're giving you that up front. It's not like we raise it up just because there's insurance involved. Mm -hmm. So you get a quote that's honest quote. And then if you get insurance money that's even more than that, that's your money. You oh, want to okay. spend on holidays? That's your money. That's not our money. You're the one that paid for the insurance. That's your benefit. So yeah. then what we're going to do 
is we're going to, if you're ready to go and insurance already came by and looked at it, we're going to schedule it and we're going to put a roof on. We have a team of 10 to 12 people. They'll show up in the morning. You'll know when. They'll get the roof off. We'll probably take the roof off, say, 7, 8 o'clock in the morning. 9 o'clock truck with material shows up, which we do have synthetic already because we don't want to be uncovered in case of weather. Okay. Okay, so we have that Excellent. roof repaired. And then the shingles show up. We install the roof. 2, 3, 4 o'clock, we're done. Sometimes sooner, on to the next in the that's summer. That's incredible. Yes. That's turnaround. And, and that's what you want, a team that's proficient, knowledgeable, professional, and does this every day. You do not want an amateur roofer on your roof. No, you don't. Maybe. There's plenty of places to save money. Roofing is not one of them. That's exactly right. You don't want to mm -hmm. cut corners when it no. comes to something this serious, for sure. That's right. Yeah, all right. Plus, you all stand behind what you do in, in each and every category. Plus, I've also heard many a time where uh, folks might call you that, that had had somebody else give them a quote, but yours was much less, and you're having to explain why. But, I mean, really, it's because you buy a lot of your stuff in bulk. Yes, that, that's yes. That's what it is. Plus, your experience also can allow you to get the job done sooner, quicker, faster turnaround time means less downtime for anybody. And But also, I mean, it, it just says a lot about your workmanship. Tell me something about that, Dan. Well, Chad, going back to the price for just a second, um, if there is a quote that's lower than ours, and that is very possible, um, I'm not saying that's not possible, but we, need, you as a consumer needs to question it. Right. Because if the price is lower, you know, the question is why? You know, what kind of company is it? Now, if it's a, if it's a profitable, uh, recognizable, good company that's mm -hmm. around here and they've done a lot of work, hey, maybe they got, you know, they got a better price for some reason, you know. But you do have to be careful what roofer you use because you don't want to go the other way with your roof. You don't want to get a quote and then get halfway into the job and then come back later and be twice as much, in other words. That's what you're yes, saying, and right? what, we've ha what we have had in the past, we've had customers call us and say, Daniel, listen, we've had this company. We thought we were saving money. They started. They're like a third done or they got my roof opened. It's a mess. I need some help. Wow. You know, and that's a horror story. You don't want that. That's exactly right. So, I mean, that's a very good piece of advice. So, if you get, I mean, if you get a quote and it's extremely low, question it, first of all, just just, just to protect your family. Call you all back out if need be, right? I'm that's sure they, right. We'll work with come people. Back out. Yeah, and just uh, and explain why it's, it may be so much lower. Maybe and you can help them insurances do help a lot of times when there's hail or wind damage. So, a lot of times it's not out of your pocket, you know, Perfect. but you do need a new roof. If you get ready to sell your house... And your roof is iffy, put a roof on, and let's pretend your roof costs eight thousand dollars. It's gonna bring you sixteen to twenty thousand in retail value of that home. So like two, yeah, it's over if, two two times the amount yes, is what you're gonna get back just for because of retail of value. People want a new home when they buy a house. That's right. A new, they new do. roof. They do. They do. And, and it's for obvious reasons. It's for these reasons right here. Because if, if, if uh, someone before you has put on that roof, then they don't really know about its durability and if it's going to hold up in the rain or the snow. And the warranties are transferable to new to new buyers of the house. Too. Yeah. Yeah. Because we, we work with nice. a lot of uh, we work with a lot of local realtors and things like that. And they'll have us come. They'll have a client um, that's maybe looking to purchase the house. And that's always a big question. Or, or um, you know, like, is this warranty transferable? Um, or maybe we just put the roof on and the, the individual is looking to sell the house. And I, I don't know how many times we've been asked that. Um, you know, the new buyer's like, well, you got a new roof on, that's great, but what if I have an issue? Um, and that's a big thing we stand, we, uh, we stand behind. Um, you know, if, if they sell that house, we still give our, our warranty just the same. We don't, you know, even though we didn't do direct business with that consumer, um, we warranty the roof, so... That's yeah. very positive right there because if folks are out there, that it, I mean, that is a good selling point for folks out there trying to sell their homes, right? Mm -hmm. That's right. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, for sure. I mean, so. that's huge. When you have a home and it's got a roof, brand new roof, it, I mean, it's it's moving ready house. Tell me about your customer service because we get a lot, a lot of calls up here complimenting your customer service. Tell me about why that stands out so much. Well, it's not me. Uh, it's, 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 I'm it's not, not the reason. Just you. No, it is not the reason. Okay. I am not the reason. Right. The crew that we have is okay. amazing. 
Uh, they clean up. They work very efficient. They're very polite. They're just, they're beautiful people when it comes. And they, they want to be on the roof. That's where they're happiest. Mm -hmm. They want to be it's on a, the roof. Beautiful. It's a they crazy thing. But if they're uh. not, they much rather be on the roof than okay. sitting at home watching TV. Fair enough. They want to be on the roof. So that's a, that's a, it's a crazy concept, but it is true. Well, did you have a good Thanksgiving? We had a wonderful <laughs> Thanksgiving. All right. And then you yeah. got a good Christmas, I'm sure, lined up. Or we're, coming to we're, very, we're very thankful. We're blessed people. God's mm -hmm. been good to us. Blessed Amen. us tremendously. All of our people, we've uh, we uh, very much feel privileged in all areas when it comes to that. Very proud to hear that. Chris yes. Myself, very, very proud to hear that. So is yes. there anything else that you guys would like to add today? Well, well, Chad, you're Are you in a hurry? <laughs> no, no, we're okay. not hurry. Right. What I was, what I mentioned earlier when I first walked in is you yeah. ought to be on TV because you're all spiffed up. Uh. <laughs> Got your nice clothes on. I don't quite fit in here. <laughs> we're just roofers, you know. Uh, oh no, you guys are more than welcome. I'm more comfortable in those clothes. Just, just for the record, I am. Uh, yeah, just you look very nice, very sharp. Thank you. You guys look sharp too. You do. Look Thank at you. home here too. Really appreciate you guys coming by today. And well, we come, we you. always enjoy uh, visiting with Fred in the morning. Great. Uh, but I was just in town, and I said, "Hey, Anthony, let's see if we can hit up the yeah, <laughs> country station. station and just let's go talk up. to Chad." All so, right. well, I appreciate so we're, you guys coming by. It's the first time you've been on the show. So yeah, yeah. Really and, glad uh, to have you. Always sure. enjoy listening to you, Chad. Appreciate that too, Dan. It's Dan from Daniel's Roofing, and your name again? Anthony. Anthony. Why awesome. can I not remember that today <laughs> for some reason? Anthony. Right. Okay, of course. And what is your position here, at Dan? Um, we're 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 partners in the roofing company, and I run day to day production. So making sure okay. uh, the, the roofing, toughest job there is it's, production. It's, it's tough, but it's you know it's important. Our 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 crew, which they do awesome awesome work, and we can trust in them, and uh, to do it to do their job and and to handle things appropriately, and they trust in in me and us to make sure that they have work, to make sure they have all the right details, um, which we work out with the homeowner ahead of time. Um, the simple, there's a lot of small details that goes into someone's roof. Um, and we like to get, collect all of that data ahead of time. That way when the roofing crew arrives, you know, they know exactly what they're doing. They can get to work and get so that roof done. you're preparing like way ahead of time yeah. before you even get started working. Yes. Yeah. And it's peace of mind for the homeowner, you know. And so, they were efficient. For example, yeah. 1230, the guys were done. Yeah. Wow. Anthony's that's, like, that's hey, real... you guys ready for another one? Just 16 square. <laughs> this is incredible. actual factual yeah, that's, today. That's today. So Anthony's incredible. like, uh, and so, you know, it's like, okay, we're going to do this one. So okay. the guys are right now roofing roof number two. And this is great because for winter, that's pretty good process. That's a great you know, process. For two roofs. One winter. day, two roofs in the winter. That's awesome. Proficient and also stand behind your work, of course. At, yes. Uh, Daniel's Roofing. All right. Better known and operated, of course. And Anthony, thanks for coming by as well. Now, what would yes, you sir. what would you say to someone that's on the fence about doing a, like a brand new roof? I mean, if if they're thinking about it but they haven't made a call yet, what would you recommend them do? Um. Well, I would start by giving us a call, but um, you know, it's winter time, so we have usually in, in this area around what February. March yeah, around that area, we, right. we, that's when we start getting like our ice storms, things like that. So if if you got a roof that's you know 15 years old or 20 years old, or you're unsure about it, or maybe you're missing a few shingles, um, that ice will get it'll stay on your roof, and once everything starts to melt, um, you'll get leaks in your valleys and in areas like that. And um, you don't want that. Yeah, and yeah, you don't want that at all. For yeah, sure. and then you and then you have damage on the inside of your home, and that's the last thing you want to deal with um after the holidays and things like that so if if you're unsure I, my advice would be just to give us a call you know we do we do free every, it's, it's free for us to come out and look at your roof we do What's free inspections on that, by the way yeah um, five seven three two three eight three one three one Yep. Easy enough. Two, yes. three, three, one, three, one in the Marble Hill area. I mean, I, oh, we go. Well, you guys are all over the Cape Jackson. Kennet, Perryville. Kennet? You're, you're okay. going far south. Molded. Yeah. Oh, my. my yeah, I was We've been to Illinois. Welcome to the swamp down there, right? Down <laughs> in Malden, right? So. And Chad, hey, a lot of people says like, hey, can you do roofs in the winter? The answer is yes. Yep. You can do two, evidently, in a day. <laughs> Here's the thing. Two, so. We need 40-degree weather <laughs> mm -hmm. oh, to okay, do the yeah. installation of the shingles. Now, okay. if it's colder in the middle or in the morning, that's okay. We can we can handle the colder in the morning, and then around right. lunchtime we like to see around forty degrees to install the shingles. That's what the manufacturers recommend. Okay. 
So and now metal, it's not a problem. We can go even colder. Uh, it's just that it's tough for the guys. If it's slating ice or wet, we're not going to roof because of dangerous, obviously. Danger, danger, you know, we don't want no one to get hurt. Um, but if like if it's like today and it's 50 degrees, so we're roofing. Mm-hmm. Evidently yeah, twice or two, two, <laughs> two roofs. roofs. In the day. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I barely That's made a, it. I barely made it to town in time because uh, I was trying to make sure the crew had that. to and then get over here yep. and then get back. But we do volume. Time. We do lots of roofs, but it's not just volume without quality. Mm -hmm. The quality is behind it as well. Quality is there. It's a veteran-owned and operated business. And yes. Anthony, and Anthony's your, of course, when you guys work together to make this thing go as smooth as as it's, as it's going. Clearly, it's going well. Well, mm -hmm. Chad, here's the thing about oh, a year ago or something. I was about running out of steam. Because to keep these okay. guys going, right. I mean, they just go, 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 go. And they, they're they not happy unless they're roofing. Unless they're on the roof. Okay. But I was, you know, I was getting really tired. Really I just, tired. I could not keep up. Right so place, Anthony right. was a God sent uh, answer to prayer. Good. He come along. He's helped me. And he's got new energy. And he wants to actually take this company and make this thing huge success in this area. Not necessarily extremely big, but just super good, efficient for this area here. I can see you light up on how important it is to have good people. Yes. And clearly, it is very okay. important to you both. To have oh, without people. the people, it's, mm -hmm. you know, it's over. If you don't have the right people, you guys know that. I mean, it's yeah, over. That's true. You got to have the right people. It's well said. Well, so, folks, uh, do you guys want to add anything else? I really appreciate y'all coming by. I can't believe it's already been almost 20 something minutes that, that we've been visiting. But <laughs> we're time talkers. flies, as they say. Yes. You're having fun, right? Yeah. We're talkers. <laughs> That's all right. It's good. You, then you're in the wrong business. You could be on this side of the no, mic no, then, no. Dan. So. Well, Chad, it's a, it, I just want to say it's a pleasure to be here. And your radio station here, that you guys do a lot for us. Um, you, you help us be known, uh, which, which means we can in turn help homeowners. So I, I just want to say I really appreciate everything y'all do for us here down at the radio station. Thanks, so. Anthony. I'll be passing that along to Fred, too, as soon as I get a chance to talk to him. I really, really, really appreciate you guys, as always, for coming in. Dan, Dan, the roofing man. And Anthony here as well from Daniel's Roofing. And, of course, it's a, well, it's a uh, veteran-owned business here in the area. So if you're looking to maybe getting some roof work done or possibly even a new roof, before you do anything, do yourselves a favor and get a hold of Daniel's Roofing. Get a hold of Anthony. Get a hold of Daniel. Give them a call, 573-238-3131 for Daniel's Roofing. Guys, thanks for coming in again. Yes, sir. Thank you. Appreciate you, and God bless you. Merry Christmas to you both. God bless you. That's uh, Anthony and, of course, Daniel from Daniel's Roofing here on Pure Country.